having us. Yeah, these kids want to look great on, on the night of their homecoming dance. And, and you have a special look that some of the, the girls are going for. What's it called? Yes, this is called Teen Glam. Wow, and what does that mean? <laughs> that means it's, it's a little bit of drama, but you still look fresh, young, and innocent. But beautiful, of course, for your homecoming dance. Yeah, so tell me what, what you did on our model here and what her name is. Well, look, um, a good way of doing this, this is Jalen. <laughs> Get my name. <laughs> this is eyeshadow, Nancy. This is a gold eyeshadow that I literally pressed on Jalen's eyelid to give a pop of color. What's great about this, you can use it in different colors like pink, silver, and purple. Line and go. Mm -hmm. And it keeps the eye beautiful, fresh, open, and then those pictures, you'll really pop. What I love about her lips as well is we did what I call contoured lips. And what that means is a 3D, 4D effect. I applied one color all over, then a second color in the center, and then a lighter color even more in the center. That gives a pout. That gives a pout. You line last for definition, Nancy. And then you can also finish it with a gloss to mm -hmm. give it an even more 4D, 3D yeah. effect. And for kids who say, I don't want the gold eyeshadow, I think that's not me, you can always tone it down and do something different, but this is just kind of a, a way to be over the top in sort of a teen magazine kind of uh, glam shot. Absolutely, right. and if you don't have the sparkle shadows yeah. that I have, you can use any type of sparkle eyeshadow that yeah. you see in a drugstore. Yeah, you can get them inexpensively in the drugstores. And, and like the old people like me, I look at them and go, <laughs> I can't wear that. But for kids, it's fun. Tell me about this model and what she's wearing. Now, this is a different type of sparkle eyeshadow. I literally just added a drop to the brush, and then you dip into the shadow and apply it lightly on top mm -hmm. in the center of the eye. If you're daring, you can go all over, but this is a sparkle eyeshadow. It's not a glitter eyeshadow, which is important because glitter has some glass particles in it. And like we said, don't uh, just use the craft store uh, uh, glitter for this because it can hurt you. Right. Now, what I did on her lips is I used a liquid um, lipstick. Mm -hmm. So we used the deeper one out all around then the lighter one in the center for the pout for the pout i lined with a deeper liner and then used a clear gloss in the center to well, give her that 3d effect and it photographs so well ladidra baldwin thanks so much for You're being welcome. on i know that went fast but we got some good <laughs> tips and you guys look great thanks yeah, a lot thank awesome. you straight ahead we take a look at uh,